Welcome back to the channel guys and another freebie alert and review. In today's show I have three very bold, vibrant and modern looking watch faces from the 2018 designer of the year and yes I'm talking about Virgin here. Now all three of these faces are available in the app store under the watch face featured section but if you can't find them then don't sweat it because I've also left the direct links right in the video description. And by the way if you missed my top free watch faces of the week video that I released yesterday then make sure you click on the link above because you still may be able to grab some of those as well. For the review today though, let's go have a closer look at these limited time freebies from Virgin. Alright, kicking things off, here's a sporty and modern looking hybrid watch face with three large dials which provide digital stats as well as colorful bar measurements. Now in that dial at the top you have your daily steps goal, the dial at the left identifies your battery remaining and then in that dial at the bottom you have your last recorded heart rate as well as an intensity zone indicator. Now the rest of your activity information is spread out on the face and it's visible on that large LCD panel background. In the bottom half you have your calories burnt with your caffeine intake to the left and your water intake and steps count is to the right of your heart rate. And staying on that right hand side of the face you also have the moon phase, the full date and the digital time there and yes that can be set in either a 12 or 24 hour format. At the top left hand corner of the display you have your floors climbed as well as your distance traveled. And as you can see you have a number of really vibrant combinations to choose from here in terms of themes. You can change the LCD panels by tapping in the 3 position. You can change the brightness levels of those panels by tapping in the 6 position. And then right at the top in the 12 position you can change the colors of those index markers around the bezel. Okay next up is another hybrid face and this one does take some styling cues from the last one as you can see there's those three large dials again on this face but on this model they're in a different layout and configuration. However the activity information they display is all the same as the previous one. On this version you have the power remaining to the left though, you have the heart rate as well as an intensity zone indicator in the dial at the bottom and your step progress is located on the right. And within that LCD panel you have your calories burnt there at the bottom left and your total steps count is just on the right hand side. Then in the top half of the face you have your floors climbed, your distance moved as well as the date and the time. And for customizations again you can change the color of those index markers around the bezel, you can change the colors of the dials plus the colors for the LCD panel so in total you have over 2700 combinations to choose from plus you also get 11 app shortcuts on this one with 8 preset to fixed apps and the other 3 are customizable. So either this this one or the previous one offer great style and a ton of personalization options. The question is which look and layout do you prefer better? Okay and the last one that you can grab right now is this all digital version which features an oversized circular display area to the left hand side there and that includes your heart rate as well as your daily steps goal completed. Now the rest of the information is shown in that large LCD panel although you do have a moon phase which is located just off to the right hand side. And starting from the top of the face well you get a power remaining gauge with your floors climbed and your water and caffeine intake shown there and then underneath those stats you have your distance traveled, your calories burnt as well as your total steps count. And the bottom half of the face is the date and the time and again like the other faces this can also be set in either a 12 or 24 hour format. Now customizations for this one include color changes to the index markers and the LCD panel but you get an added option of dimming the brightness of the background which is a really nice option to have particularly if you find yourself in a low lighting environment and you want to make those face details easier to see and read. And lastly this one comes with the most shortcuts of the faces that I have reviewed so far as you have a total of 14 here with 11 that are assigned to fixed apps and the other 3 shortcuts are customizable. All 
All right, guys, that wraps up another review. And remember that all three of these Burgeon phases are on limited time promos that are set to expire by end of day Friday. So while you do have some time to grab these, I wouldn't delay too long. And please share this information with others because anytime you can pick up Burgeon faces for free is really a bonus. And don't forget to grab the freebies I showcased in yesterday's review because there were some real beauties there as well. I'll catch you guys in the next episode and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Until then, take care. Thanks again for watching our review and if you liked it then show us some love with a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and share the video with your friends because with your support it really helps me keep the channel going so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways and of course fresh content. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.